Scientists have hit an amazing breakthrough in the fight against HIV. We are going to tell you all about it here on IO. Hello friends, welcome back to Inform Overload. My name is Charlotte and thanks for clicking on this video. I finally have some fantastic news for you. Researchers from the US National Institutes of Health have discovered an antibody that can neutralize 98% of HIV strains. For those that don't know, an antibody is a protein produced by the immune system in response to harmful pathogens like bacteria and viruses. The the antibody is called N6 and its discovery is the most promising to date after several failed attempts to neutralize HIV. HIV rapidly changes its surface proteins so your immune system can't recognize it to figure out how to fight it off. It is unique from other viruses because it attacks your immune system which is what your body needs to fight off disease. That's the horrible thing about HIV. It's not necessarily the virus itself that kills you, it's your body's inability to fight off other infections. Without treatment, a person suffering from HIV will live 9 to 11 years. Now, the antibody N6 was found in an HIV patient's blood. N6 blocks the virus and prevents it from attaching itself to immune cells. Scientists at the National Institute of Health, which is the largest biomedical research agency in the world, are currently testing N6 to see if it can safely prevent HIV in humans. There was another antibody called BRC01 that was discovered back in 2010 that prevents infection, but that antibody was not as effective as N6. It only neutralized 90% of the HIV strains, but it did protect monkeys against HIV for 6 months. N6 will offer treatment that is stronger and more effective. Wouldn't it be amazing if HIV became a thing of the past like so many diseases that used to kill people by the thousands? There might be a day when you just get a shot at school when you're a kid and then you never have to worry about HIV. Apparently N6's ability to neutralize almost all strains of HIV will make it useful for treatment and prevention. So that means people that already have HIV can be treated and you can prevent yourself from getting it in the first place. The results have only been demonstrated in a lab, and until we test N6 on humans, we don't know how effective it actually is. There were approximately 36.7 million people worldwide living with HIV at the end of 2015. Out of that number, 1.8 million were children younger than 15 years old. Most of the people living with HIV are from low and middle income countries. It will still be a little while before scientists research, test, and create a cure, but they now have the tools to make a vaccine for HIV, and the millions suffering from it now have hope. Wow, some good news for a change. Yay! Okay, guys, it's time to respond to some of your comments. These comments are from our Alien Cop Stalking Curiosity Rover video. Lauren Jackson said, If there was a new planet that you have to name, what would you call it? Um, potato. <laughs> Morbo the Destroyer said, Do you ever report real news? Why would we do that? Real news sucks. Just so you know, you should probably not watch IO if you're looking for real news. You should probably, I don't know, pay for a newspaper or something. MK Ahmed said, they're so cute together, but then Charlotte and Jared are cute together as well. Why do I have to pick between Jared and Charlie? Don't hate the player. Hate the game. Okay guys, that's all for now. Thanks for watching IO, and you have just been informed.